Brown Jay Brown Good Morning, Day 4. I got my best coffee. I'm going to use tea anyway. Got my best coffee going on here. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Making me some of the best coffee on the planet. Ayako coffee. How's everyone doing this morning? Awesome and amazing, awesome and amazing guys. So, these are the tips of the day. Let me put some water in here. Get some water in my cup. Guys, be blessed. Bless y'all. Hey guys, hey guys. Remember, I'm going to put this on my YouTube channel. So, you can actually follow me over there on my YouTube channel. So, here's the tip of the day, guys. If you are over 50 years old, guys, and you still live with mom, then you got to get your priority together. Right? you got to get your priority together. I know people who are 50-year-old infants still living with mom. You know, guys, if you come on here, share the screen, and, you know, show love, guys. But I'm going to put this on my YouTube, uh, my YouTube channel. Um, you know, but there are 50-year-old infants, guys, that still live with mom. See, you know, when you are a teenager and you're in your 20s and your 30s, guys, you should be really planning what you want to do, right? Because by the time you're 50 years old, you should not be living with the mother. You know, you really should not be living with mom. But there's a lot of people, 50-year-old, 60-year-old, living home with their parents. So guys, at some point, gonna come a point, I was talking to, you know, these two young ladies on my block and I said, there's gonna come a point in your life where you're gonna either turn around and say, fuck it, I'm not gonna go forward, or you're gonna go over the hurdle so that you can move forward, right? So you, so that when that point comes, you now have a choice. See, this is why we have a choice, guys, to, to um, you know, to, to manifest things in our life to control our life. Because the point is, is either you're going to turn around and do nothing with your life, or you're going to go over the hurdle and do something. So if you're 50, 60 years old, you're still living with mom, obviously you decided to turn back. You didn't want to have more. You didn't want to do more. You didn't want to be more. You didn't want to, see you later. You, you didn't really have a priority. So your priority was when you were five to live with mom, and then now you're 50, you're still living with mom. And now there's different certain situations where people got to go live back with their parents because they lost their job or whatever. But there's people that never left their mother's home. Okay? There's people, guys, that never ever left their parents' home and they're still there and they don't plan on leaving. Right? So this is why I said, guys, know what your priority is. Don't be a 50-year-old infant living with your parents. All right? Know what your priority is and go forward. All right? Don't be 50 years old, depending on mom. Depending on mom to wash your clothes. Depending on mom, okay, to, to cook your meals. And you're 50, right? But this is happening a lot. A lot of men and women, single men and women. See, God put us on earth so we can go find somebody, so we can go mate and, and get married and have children, right? So all these people who are miserable and they single, simply, guys, is because they didn't make a decision that, you know what? I want to be out of my mother's house. I don't want to be living with my mother at 50. I don't want to be having the same type of money when I was five years old. So these are all of the things, guys, that we got to go through. Guys, these are all of the things that these 50-year-old infants are going through. All right? They're not prioritizing. All right? They're not, right, being focused on a goal. And they just want mom to take care of them. Guys, I am not interested in that. I am not interested in that. I'm 33, guys. 33, guys. Been on my own since I was 25. Okay, 33. Been on my own since I was 25 years old, guys. I'm not interested in living with my mom, grandma, none, mom, nothing, right? So you, whoever, if you're watching this and you're a 50-year-old infant living with mom, you need to make a decision today and say, I want more. I don't want to be living with mom. Mom is, you know, mom is 70 years old, 80 years old. What happens when mom dies? Right? You're going to be crying? Right? You're going to what, go homeless? You're going to hope and pray that another mother comes? No. You got to do something now, guys. Make it a priority for you to do more so that when things do get bad, you're not binded. So remember that, guys. Remember that. Like I said, I'm drinking my coffee. 
hustle hard. It, it said real women hustle hard. This shit hot. It said real women hustle hard on here. Um, but the real woman part uh, kind of like fell off a little bit. So I got some almond milk here, guys. Pour some almond milk in my cup. And this coffee, guys, with this Gano in it improves eyesight. It has improved my eyesight. I had to get three different um, prescriptions since I've been drinking this coffee for about, I'll say eight months. About eight months I've been drinking this coffee, and it is amazing, guys. So, if you want some coffee, go to MyHerbTea.com, guys. But remember, don't be a 50-year-old infant, guys. Don't be a 50-year-old infant depending on mom or grandmom. Do something better with your life. Do something different with your life so that you can have different things in your life and be more productive. Guys, I'm going to put this on my YouTube channel, guys. See you soon.